Hello boys and girls, this is Soloride and in today's video we are going to take a look at the Star Wars white transitions and how to recreate them in DaVinci Resolve. If you're interested, stay tuned. <laughs> The use of transition wipes in Star Wars movies was a signature choice by George Lucas to move from one scene to another. He was inspired by similar wipes used in the films of Akira Kurosawa, whose movies had great influence on the style of the original Star Wars. According to the Visual Guide to Star Wars, an excellent and fun read by Tim Leung, white transitions were used more than 300 times in the first six episodes. Being episode 3, The Revenge of the Sith, the clear winner with 102 wipe transitions. Lucasfilm used many different kinds of transition wipes, side to side, split top to bottom, windshield wiper, elevator doors, corner wipes and many many more. The most common transition wipe in Star Wars is the side to side wipe which has been used 80 times. Ok guys, now we are going to try to recreate some of those Star Wars wipe transitions and to get started I put two small video clips into my timeline down here. DaVinci Resolve already comes with a number of wipe transition effects and you have access to them with opening the effects library and then go down to the video transitions and then go all the way down to the wipe transitions. So you already have a number of transitions there. However, none of these transitions is going to be a perfect remake of the Star Wars transitions. So we are going to make a few changes to the standard band wipe transitions. Um, just drag it over on top of your clips, just in the middle where the transition should be happening. And then make sure your inspector window is open and select it so that gets a red border so now you can here see the video transition style and the first thing you want to do is change this to slide so now we have a slide transition going on here now two things are wrong first of all it's in the wrong direction it's sliding from the left to the right we want to have it from the right to the left so just change this property here and the next thing that you realize if you go in here is that the border between the two uh, video clips is very sharp in the Star Wars effects it's a feathered border and we have to make a number of changes to have it look like it so the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna move down here to the slide section of the properties and uh, we make some border something like well let's say 70 should be good so now you get this nice border here uh, that is moving around still not what we want but the feather checkbox is the one we need so you see it now it's like the Star Wars transition maybe make the border a bit wider like this and let's try it again very nice now of course you also can change the sliding preset to top down so now you get this effect that the wipe is going from the top to the bottom of the video by changing the video transition style uh, you actually can create quite a lot of those Star Wars transition effects. So, for instance, let's try um, the clock wipe, for instance, is heavily used as well. Start it. Looks familiar, doesn't it? Another one that you can use because it's used frequently is the eye iris. 
you also can make it uh, the barn door so you see there are many transitions in DaVinci Resolve to be explored that actually really can be used for recreating Star Wars wipe transitions. I hope this video was useful to you and you enjoyed it. If you did, please consider to subscribe to my channel, give me a thumbs up, hit the bell, this would be very helpful. I wish you a nice weekend and goodbye.